Nigel Mai, for Nigel Tristan Davies, four Wakanda, five is Catco, David Noonan and David Pipe, six Otago Trail, Liam Treadwell, Venetian Williams, seven definitely red, Brian Hughes, eight no planning, nine Clondor Knight. All today. That's it, it's a, it's a strong race now and hey, hopefully Bristol to May should back on his ground and do really well. Okay, you like Bristol to May, fair enough, I can see that. Jim? Definitely red has a clear form chance. Here's Mark Johnson. For the At The Races rehearsal handicap chase over very nearly three miles and Bristol the Mai through on the inside of last year's winner Wakanda and Otago Trail around the outside are the first three as they head towards the first of 19 fences as they head into the back straight. Bristol de Mai on the inside, Wakanda between horses, Otago Trail towards the outside, Virac and then Katko as they go over the first and Katko is down. Katko has gone at the first and hampered at the first was Clondor Knight. Dropping to the back of the field of Bishop's Road as they go over fence number two. And the leader was Bristol de Mai. To Wakanda in second, Otago Trail in third, and then Virac in fourth and definitely red. Over fence number three, the last trio, no planning. And then Clondor Knight, and on that one's outside is Bishop's Road. They go now on towards fence number four. Scanning back, horse and rider up okay from the tumble at the first fence of Catco. As they go now towards the fourth, Bristol de Mai and Daryl Jacob will lead by a length. And they jump it well, a slight mistake there by no planning, whose rider went to the buckle end. And also definitely red wasn't too slick over that, racing in six, the gamble of the race. As they go on now towards fence number five, Bristol de Mai the leader, a mistake in second by Wakanda. Otago Trail was over in third, Virac on the inside is in fourth, then definitely red and no planning. A break of around about two and a half lengths to Bishop's Road, who's towards the outside of Clondor Knight. So they make the turn into the home straight, facing up now towards the second of the open ditches, fence number six in the At The Races rehearsal handicap chase, being run here at Newcastle for the tenth time this afternoon. Bristol de Mai stands a long way off that and jumps it really well to last year's winner Wakanda over in second and then Otago trail together with Virac on the inside Virac who was runner-up 12 months ago over another plain one and it was Bristol de Mai who led Wakanda in second Virac on the inside now just about third with no planning Otago trail and then very wide definitely red getting a good sight of his fences that will be two out next time Demai still out in front, bidding to give Daryl Jacob his fourth win on this big afternoon here at Newcastle. Comes now towards fence number nine. Bristol Demai led Wakanda over in second. Otago Trail in third. Virac was just ridden away from that fence on the inside rail. He's in fifth, just in behind. No planning. Then definitely red and Bishop's Road. And the back marker is Clondor Knight as they head out now into the country. They've got ten more fences to take, and Bristol Namai leads by about a length and a half to Wakanda in second. His stable mate, no planning, moving up now to take third. Otago Trail quite wide on the track. Then on the inside is Virac, followed by Bishop's Road. Still taken very wide is Definitely Red. That's been a noticeable tactic by Brian Hughes here on Definitely Red. He's giving up the outside to no one, but he is getting clear sailing, and the back marker is Clondor Knight. So they go through the halfway point of the rehearsal, on now towards fence number 10, and the grey Bristol Namai will still just have the lead, measured it really well. Down there is no planning, no planning has fallen at fence number 10. So now they're about to make the turn into the back straight, and Bristol Namai leads a Targo trail in second place, Virac and definitely Red. Wakanda didn't jump that last fence terribly well. He's been shuffled back now to fifth position with Bishop's Road in sixth and Clondor Knight is last of the seven who remain as they make the run now on towards the back straight. And Bristol to Mai still going the shortest way. Daryl Jacob aboard. Jumps the next gets in quite tight and has a little bit of a nod on landing over a Targo trail and Liam Treadwell and then definitely Red and Brian Hughes towards the outside. Virac and Harry Cobden now back in fourth position as they got over that open ditch and the last two are Wakanda who appears to be on the back foot now and Bishop's Road and a long long way back now to Clondor Knight who has been pulled up so they go over the middle fence down the back a depleted field in the rehearsal just the six of them remain 
Bristol Dubai to Otago Trail in second. Definitely red, closing up in third. So too is Bishop's Road now in fourth between horses. Virac ridden towards the inside rail and out wide is Wakanda as they got over that next fence. The second last fence down the back. Bristol Dubai now being taken on again by Otago Trail. A length and a half back to the third, definitely red. And then Bishop's Road who continues to catch the eye. Closing up, but he gets in tight there and surrendered vital ground but he's still there in fourth position where Kanda is in fifth and Virak now begin to feel the pitch the top weight six and last of those who remain in the 2016 running of the at the races rehearsal chase and it is Bristol Demai on the inside with Otago Trail these two exchanging blows then on the inside is Bishop's Road he's now taken third definitely red still going wide in fourth here's the final ditch it's four out Bristol Demai he breasted that fence but he's still got the lead but now he's tackled every step of the way by Otago Trail. Back in third is Bishop's Road. Last year's winner Wakanda is beginning to stay on once again. Over three out, Otago Trail on the outside of Bristol Demai. They've now got a three length break over Bishop's Road. Wakanda and definitely red towards the outside. Here's the second from home. On the inside, a slight mistake by Bristol Demai. More fluent on the near side, Otago Trail. And Otago Trail goes on and now he asserts, goes clear by a length and a half. The 19th and final fence in the rear. Rehearsal, Otago trail by two lengths. Bristol Mai in second. Definitely Red is back in third. They've got less than a half furlong to go. Driven out by Liam Treadwell, it will be Otago Trail who wins the rehearsal chase. Bristol Mai was in second, definitely Red in third, and Bishop's Road was fourth. Otago Trail on his seasonal reappearance for Venetia Will Williams and Liam Treadwell back in the headlines once again. That was a very impressive performance. A horse who had to prove his stamina. Uh, Sam, Bristol De Mai ran really well. Yeah, he ran a cracker, but I think the real thing is for Liam Treadwell. He's spent a, a good amount of time with him in the gym in Oaksley House, and obviously great to see him back riding on the big stage and the big winners. I mean, he's a great lad and a real talent. Uh, Jim, they went a decent gallop.